what's up guys and welcome to another video today we are outside no makeup just getting some sun we are away from the sun bustle and today we are just in the countryside today i'll be doing a day in my life just to relax get grounded walk barefoot so i'll be just showing you what it's like in the country so today one of the things i normally do is walk my dog I well, haven't seen in a long while due to work life, you know. So. First, I'll be walking my dog, and then I'll be showing you a little bit about country life in Jamaica and all of that. So now we're gonna go visit my dog who keeps steering down his horse. This dog just likes to dig. Let's go guys. Hi Rambo. The guys here is Rambo. He was just jumping up on me. I can't wait to be in the for him to take his walk. We <laughs> had him since he was a pup. Hey. It's a little bit of a trouble. We always find some way to get away <laughs> and ruin my clothes. Let me see if we can get him to walk. I already fed him and um, look at this guy. He tore down his house and dug out inside. That's him. Just like to be free and he's very reckless, so that's me trying to get away from him. I'm not sure if I'll be able to film while I am um, giving him a run, but let's see. Alright guys, so one thing you need to have when you come to Jamaica is your repellent right now. I'm using my offspring because outside, as the tourists would say, they are tearing me up. So First side report. He's ready. So the overseas dogs stay inside the house and all that. We just let them loose out here. Alright, one. But in this is me just after running a while ago. See this? This is the result of it. Because, because we have neighbors, we can't really let him the way we want to. Normally, we've had so many neighbors, we just let him while they can just run loose in the bushes, catch mangoes, and all those things. But we have neighbors, and he's very only. Love to walk about the place and all that, so we have to keep him tied up. However, when you say same while they find some way to escape. So as promised, I said I was going to show you some of the things that we have in the yard that most people in the town have to buy. So in Jamaica, in the countryside, they mostly have board houses. Everything is outside, so the bathroom is outside, the toilet is outside, the kitchen is outside. Uh, you may find few wall houses, but it's mostly boy houses. You guys, we're starting off with our beautiful lime tree. It goes all the way up. It's actually starting to blossom again. Just finished. Crop was just came up. We still have one lime remaining. Lucky lime remaining. Yeah, but just got some lime off it. I know it's ready to be here again because that famous lime tree is really the famous lemonade from. I'd be proud to buy all these things in one to okay? Now we're moving on to our awesome pear tree. It's, it's 
pair of tans. So we have one pair in the middle right there. Going around. Now this is a guinea tree, but it has never bought any guinea. Like I think it's a man guinea because it's a man guinea tree is over right here. Whether you have the famous Aki tree as well, it's now Aki time. Have a few left on it. We have a mango tree right there. And one of our Jamaica, one of the things that is a part of our meals here in Jamaica is banana. You know, we get banana chips from this, as well as cooking banana. Some of them come down and get ripe banana from it. So we have these right in the backyard, guys. Um, this other tree here is a tree that my mom planted for a cherry tree. There it is. We don't have any cherries on it right now. So you can see it's blossoming. It's blossoming at the top right there. So you know, soon we'll have some cherries. So we have a banana walk in the backyard. My mom is a farmer. She grows things. And we do have a bit of compost around here. So we throw all the peel skins and all that around here. As you can see, cannot leave out the yard for they eat everything there, uh, everything and nearly as well. So we have a deer coop somewhere down there. So this is just in my backyard. Also before we get there, let me show you. We have the pepper tree here and beautiful peppers on it. And all people in the town have to buy all of this. And they have big. So then we have a jackfruit tree. So are you tree. Okay, guys, okay, so we're taking a walk in the back part of the yard. Where we have our star fruit tree. Actually, we have a lot of star fruit trees. This one is out in the back, it's one of our youngest star fruit trees. All the way out there. I have to test one of them. I don't really like star food. I'm gonna test one. Mm. I have our amazing apple tree out here. Apple is not in season right now, but when it does, I'll show you what it looks like. One of my favorite fruits. I have another apple tree out here. I have another mango tree over there. Guava tree. Okay, another lemon tree over here. Okay, the mustard. That's right. So there is a lemon tree. I don't think I have much lemon on it right now. We have one. And we have pines as well. Got pines. Pine trees. And this is one of our Jamaican bush tea. This is fever grass which we used to make tea. Makes lovely tea. Down here we have some plantain trees and banana trees. So people in the town have to buy all of these things. So we have them in our backyard, guys. from this section of the yard because the mosquitoes are tearing me up. I'm going to go to the front of my yard to show you some more trees. I'm going to get some lime to make some lemonade and get the hell out of this place. Okay, so I got the lime. This is going to make my way out. I'm gonna have to run back for that because I don't want any mosquitoes to follow me into the house. So let's go. So guys, when I think of the country, I think of bush. There's a lot of bush in the countryside. So during COVID, I was trying to plant some stuff, but. Oh guys, I just looked and saw that the June plum tree has got some June plums on it. On it. So like I said guys, lots of fruit trees, but because of time and everything, work and everything, place has gotten so bushy, 
right there we have a coconut tree guys come to jamaica you have to have a coconut there's a coconut tree and sometimes guys you just need to stop and enjoy a moment take some time away from the busy country life some people don't have a country to go to take some time spend some time with your family get some fresh air get grounded you know it's actually really even revitalizing and refreshing because when I come to the country I don't think about work spend time with my family have some fun and just relax can't be too busy these days to take a break and you know instead of spending money to buy some stuff in the country in the in the town area you just come to the country relax have a coconut like today I'm wondering if I can get coconuts I'm gonna have to ask somebody to get one down for me because guys when it comes to coconut tree and me picking it I don't have the patience the energy and the trees are so tall and the bamboo is so heavy so I'm gonna have to ask somebody because I'm in the bushes because I'm trying to find my way to my little farm that I planted during COVID but it is so bushy and I'm scared because my neighbor is not here to accompany me but my mom so I think what I'm gonna have to do is buy some spray to spray out the place and then because I always make it here and I can't go further. I'm gonna show you what I'm looking at. Yeah, so this is a path to go down to my little groom, my little Jamaicans call it, like my little farm, my little farm. But it's so bushy because it's been a while since I've been down there. But I realize that the, the area doesn't bring forth. It's, not, it's like it's not fertile enough. The thing that I planted didn't come out to anything much, guys. this like this is an early morning thing to do we can't do this thing so not guys like I'm gonna attempt this one early morning another time not more busy today because it is like 12 o'clock let me see what time you can see what time it's almost midday guys and the sun is ripe and I just can't take the heat so I'll make my way back up into civilization but look at my little June plum tree June plum tree has some June plums on it, guys. It's one of my other favorite fruit. It's all the way over there, but I'm not going into the wishes today. So, I this is our famous cashew tree. The beer is every year. It looks so well this year. This is in my backyard. We have another. I have my peas tree, which I have gotten peas from many times during COVID.
a joke around on social media with cats, but actually I love cats. I'm gonna show one of our newest edition. Hi! She's actually a twin. Okay guys, so the cats have kittens, but we don't know where they are. But I heard some soon, so let's go find them. exhausted from the sun and all but guys welcome to Jamaica where it's no hotter than ever so I'm just gonna eat a piece of cane that I got it's great to just step away from work and just get into the country setting for a while it can be so hectic and hot in the city in the town there's a lot of fresh air which is good for you Take off your shoes, get grounded, and spend time with your family. And just while I'm here, that's just what I do. Away. It goes away for a long time in the country. It's been almost around four months now since it's been in water at five. So it looks like it's going to rain. This now the sky is looking. So I'm just gonna lock up and everything event is on a holiday break. It's expected to come back today. Guys, it is raining. Hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is my auntie and I'm Kaim and today I'm just going to be trying on my new shoes for school. give away this bag if you subscribe and hit that <laughs> bell and like Boy, it, <laughs> and that is the end of the video <laughs> two days to go to school guys that's a sunday evening video wanted to have some more fun outside and play with football but rain came so at the end of the video here and time is back from holiday how was your holiday time <laughs> good 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 how do you feel to go going back to school good bye, bye.